Good evening, my friends, and welcome back to the next episode of Hollow Knight. Today, I've been teasing you guys for long enough. We are going to the White Palace. We've got Gramafly's Elegy. We've got Grub Song. We take ourselves some deep focus. And then... I'm not sure, actually. What's best for our, uh, for our final two slots? Could do Lifeblood Heart. Probably not worth it, to be fair. Dash Master. Could be pretty useful. Uh, Sharp Shadow is an interesting one, actually, because... I have a feeling Sharp Shadow maybe counts as a pogo. Oh, no, no, but it changes, it changes your dash length. No, no, no. We do not want that. We're going to the Hidden Station. Let's go. Now this should make it a lot faster for us to get through the White Palace. And after we've done the White Palace, we will be hitting up Path of Pain. <laughs> Here we go. So this is the dream version of the palace which has subsequently fallen totally into ruin. Wah! Wah! Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, this guy hits for two each time. Okay, deep focus it up, please. Oh, of course, and I don't have any range... Damn. Oh! King's Mold. Guard construct of Hallownest's palace and skilled wielder and curved claw blade. Its heavy white armor protects a fragile body. Do you know what? That maybe changes the equation of Path of Pain slightly, right? Because you got to fight two of those guys at the same time at the end of Path of Pain, right? Now, remember, I've never done Path of Pain. I've never done it. Um, I've seen it. So I know what awaits us at the end of that. And two of those guys, without the correct charm, seems like a bad idea. So, for example... Yeah, if you're not using Sharp Shadow, dashing through these guys does not count as a hit. Oh, and we've got Wing Mold, a fly-like construct formed of white shell and dark liquid interior. So if I put Sharp Shadow on, I have a feeling that dashing through them No, it doesn't. No. Dashing through them with Sharp Shadow does not reset you in the same way that Pogoing does. Well, in that case, then, Sharp Shadow is a terrible idea for this level. And actually, something as simple as a uh, Long Nail probably helpful just to increase our range a touch. For the regular White Palace, though, we don't really have many enemies to worry about, so I think... Yeah, so I think, given that we don't have very many enemies to worry about, this is, this is broadly speaking, just a platforming challenge. I think we'll keep the deep focus, but when it comes to Path of Pain, we might go back to Hive Blood and, and do it the slow way. Oh, another one of these guys. Okay, fine. Okay, so even without Shaman Stone, spamming them with the shade 
they do go down pretty easily. They say the old king died long ago, but his influence echoes around us still. A creature like that, what did he desire? So I believe, and we can test this out, that with my, yeah, with my new uh, abilities, Hitting spikes now actually gains us soul net, which is what we need to be effectively functionally immortal in this um, in this area. Hmm. Okay, where are we going here? Doesn't look like there's anything down there. So that's now illuminated. And we've got the fast. Thing comes this way. How strange. going. We've not even actually reached the White Palace itself yet. Ah, right. Ah, we open the doors and here's the lift. Right, so we've opened the lift, is it? I don't think we're actually even into the White Palace itself yet, are we? Because I certainly recall the White Palace was full of bugs. Yeah, you can hear them talking. Yes, here they are. Hello. Oh, they recognize me as the king. We will wait, king. Oh, shoot. We accidentally killed him. Okay. Oh, do they all say that? Any, any variation? King, your troubles, let us. Okay, so we've got, I believe it's a kind of left path, right path, upper path kind of deal. So let's hit up the right hand path first. Okay, this is where it's gonna start getting crazy. So enjoy. <laughs> okay, I thought maybe I'd get that like straight up on the first attempt, but no, that's not gonna be it. Oh, okay, okay. Quick heal. Take the double heal. We'll get up get ourselves up to max. Okay. Oh no, right, we need to we need to drop into that gap and then just we need to drop into that gap and then just drop, yeah? Ah, I need I need the arc. I need the arc on that one. I tell you what though, this is much, much faster than with hive blood. Okay, I was totally, totally mistiming that one. Okay, here we go. That one was kind of close. There we go. That's it, that's it, that's it. 
Right, first path of pain challenge done. Okay, take a rest here. Ah, no, accidentally mis uh, misjudged the wall slightly. Okay, get in there. Should have seen that one coming. Ah! <laughs> we can do it. We can do it. There we go. We got it, we got it. Is there anything this way? Is there anything this way? No. This is fine. It's effectively like uh, Dark Souls rules as well, right? Because like... You can fail it as many times as you want. You only need to beat it once, you know? As long as you've got hive blood or grubber flies elegy, you fail it as many times as you want. You only need to win one time. Oh, I accidentally, uh, accidentally moth winged when I shouldn't have done. Okay, it's enough to put us onto this spot here. Wait, what? Yeah, we can't go that. Oh, 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 we're going down that. We're going down that path. Okay, taking a triple heal. No, okay, we just want to go straight down. Hey, I didn't I didn't think I actually touched this one. But it's counting me as if I touched it. Okay, maybe we just walk off it. Yeah, we just walk off it. Nope. Okay. Oof. Hey, we are here. Right, we are going for that one down there. Ah, no, gotta gotta anticipate it a little bit more. Oh, oh, just just got on there. Okay. Ah, I thought I'd get that. I thought I'd get it. Hmm. On the way up, not so much. Right, that's fine. Need a little bit more height. A little bit more height. No, other way round. Let's take a double heal here. There we go. That's how we do that. Oh, 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 I see, I see, I see. This is actually a platform. I was like, are we supposed to put pogoing on that or what? Excellent, we are safe. Anything down here that's worth uh, looking at? Does not look like it, does it? Oh. 
Hello. King, your troubles let us. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Ha ha ha, right, we've got to wait for that one to be above us, actually. Ah, and then we're going to the middle, fine. Whip, 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 whip. And we're here. Oh. And we're going to switch. Excellent. So that is the first part of the White Palace done. Let's go over to the right-hand side of the palace now. There is a bench here somewhere as well, actually. There it is. Hello, hello, hello. Yes, I am your king. Uh, no, that's... No, not that way either. Is it this way? Yes. If you hear the whirring of blades, you're going in the right place. You're going in the right direction. We're going to be a bit faster on that one. Good. Okay, so far so good on that. Ooh, okay, didn't see that coming. <gasps> A little bit too soon. Okay. Not quite. Wait, where did that drop us? Oh, okay. <gasps> Ooh, slightly disagree. <laughs> ah, come on! I can see the people in the YouTube comment section right now being like, this guy's never going to beat Path of Pain. He's never going to beat Path of Pain. No, you guys are underestimating my sheer belligerence. Oh. Ah. Not quite. Nope. Tell you what, those are fast, aren't they? They're fast. Oh, okay. Well, we did... But did you die? Uh-oh. No, probably better that we don't touch anything on our way down, though. We can do this. We can do this. Come on. Let's take a heal. Let's take a heal. What am I doing? What am I doing? Don't go when the thing's literally about to move into you. Yeah, okay. And that's no good either. I don't think we have time to do it from that direction, you know? I think we actually want to do it when it's behind us, like this. Because then we can do that. Yeah. Oh no, but then we... Ah. You get what I mean though, yeah? Nearly, nearly. I think we want to actually just... Wrong way. Okay. Oof, right, we're here, we're here. Next safe spot. Uh, yeah, 
Okay, well we can uh, we can just take a crystal dash to get there a lot safer. I think we want to do it when they're going the other way, you know? Yep, 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 yep. I think there's space to stand there. Mm, maybe. Hard to say, hard to say. I guess we could try and crystal dash it. Oh no, we can't, because there's a big old saw, literally. Okay, right, we are in a safe spot. The next safe spot is about halfway along the next window pane, but I wonder if we can actually get to the next spot after that. Mm, not quite. There we go. Okay. We want to get halfway to the next window. Oh, oh, that was really close. That was really close. I think we want to I think we do want to go under this blade, you know. Oh, okay, right, right, right. No, uh, maybe over, maybe over the blade. Maybe over the blade. Oh. It's nearly, nearly it. It was nearly it. Oh, you got you gotta be real precise on this section. Maybe actually just walking is better. <laughs> Maybe walking is just better. Oh! <sighs> getting there, though. Getting there. Little bit of overcorrection. Okay. I don't know. Is there an easier way you're supposed to be able to do this? I don't know. It's White Palace. None of none of it has an easy way. It's 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 a skill check. The whole thing is a skill check. Oh no, we went way too far that time. Okay. Oh! 
We're getting really... Oh, we got really close there. If we can get to those last three, we just dash through the last of it. It's an exercise in patience, this one, for sure. This is the point where some speedrunner is going to point out that actually, like, it, as long as you start at the correct spot, you can actually just, like, walk and, and don't break pace. You just keep moving forward and it's fine. Or you crystal dash at just the right time and you avoid everything. It's, it's, it's one of those, like, style challenges, isn't it? Okay, take some heals. Got to take some heals. I mean, this is the kind of this is the kind of high octane gaming content you guys come here for, right? Don't know why I jumped. Literally no idea why I jumped there. No need to jump there. Way too quick. And I did it again. I'm anticipating it too hard now. Okay, here we go. Oh my god. I can't believe I got to the final one and then scuppered it twice. Am I just not challenging the saw blades closely enough? Is that where I went wrong there? I don't think it can be a crystal dash, right? Oh, maybe it is a crystal dash. I don't know. Oh dear, oh dear. Okay. Feel free to start using the skip ahead 30 seconds button, right? Because, like, I don't know how long this is going to take. in sync with the timings. Very little space to manoeuvre, isn't it? Right. We're going when it goes up, yeah? Damn. Okay. Anticipate that better. Nope. 
pretty sure we're going when it's at the upper side, you know? Ran out of juice, ran out of juice. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Surely, surely that's a crystal dash, actually, isn't it? Hmm, I don't know. The fact that it's opposite a saw makes me think maybe it's not a crystal dash. Mm -hmm. It would help if I could, like, accurately target my crystal dash. That will work. That will work 100%. I need to I need to break almost immediately. There we go. We are in. That opens up now the central elevator. Oh, we're not going up there just yet, though. I want to have a rest up at this bench. Okay. Off we go. Now the path of pain, I believe, is it's like a breakable wall on the left somewhere. I don't know. But you can you can I'm pretty sure pretty sure you can come back here even after you've beaten Path of Pain. Pretty sure you can do that. Sorry, I'm pretty sure you can come back here even after you've beaten White Palace to do Path of Pain. So we're going to do White Palace first, and we're going to come back for part of the pain, yeah? Not quite. Come on, get out of here. Oh, no! Well, that's a very good reason why we need to not make sure we don't just go on two masks, right? Gap is tight, isn't it? It's a tight, tight gap. There we go. You can certainly use the fact that bumping into them doesn't reset your position a little bit, can't you? We've got we to gotta be a little bit more um, challenging of the bugs, less challenging of the saws, right? Because, yeah, the bugs, we can, we can handle the bugs. There we go. That's how you do it. It's not Crystal Dash at all. Ah, we've got a bench. Lovely. 
Oh, I wonder if there's another bench anywhere along this path. Oh, hang on, wait. Does that mean the path of pain is somewhere here? I don't know. Could be up here somewhere. Hmm. That was dumb. Need to get a little bit faster on that. Dash Master seems like it would be a really good thing to have, to be honest. <gasps> That's not where we're trying to go at all. Where are we even trying to go from there, then? No, we want, we want, I think we want dash and then jump, isn't it? There we go, that's where you want to be. Okay, I, I see it, I see it. Fine. We are okay there. Nope. <laughs> nope. Oh, shoot. That is not much space to Mantis Claw. There we go. Right. We do it in one. It's a lot, lot smoother. Okay. Nope. Okay, a couple heals. literally dashed the wrong way. Okay. Right, we're going up and to the left. Oh, a little bit faster than that. Very nice, very nice. Now. Now. got to get the timing absolutely perfect on that and that's that's okay then should have taken the wall should have taken to the wall instead progress though to be fair gotta do better than that no 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 chance you definitely have to be jumping initially whilst they're still out and maybe even dashing into them I mean, you can almost make it to the top um, with a flap, just without even... There we go. Now, I 
think by this point we've probably missed where the Path of Pain starts, so we're going to have to look that up on a map at some point, I think. Okay, so we've got some chaps in there. Okay, here we go. Not quite, not quite. Oh no, it's not going to count that. Nope, okay, take a heal. Take a heal, take a heal. Make sure we touch the ground, just in case it decides to be weird with us. Okay, here we go. Oh, okay, we've got to be a little bit more accurate with our... Uh, like, this has got to be a crystal dash, right? I don't see any other way we're possibly getting through that gap. Ha ha ha! Trick spike, alright. You can't pogo off the... Like, you, you can pogo off the saw blades, but not when they are coming up towards you. F. No, that's not it. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Right. Can I just get straight up there without using... <gasps> you can! You don't have to use that at all. Okay. My exact worst kind of... Uh, my exact worst kind of puzzle. The one where we've got to know exactly how far we can dash from. Let's line up with this uh, pillar here. Not quite. I, unlike last time, I don't. I think these are far too fast to be able to just walk through. Yeah. That was pretty close, actually. It's sort of around this pillar, nearly, but you can't really position yourself. Okay. Do I crystal dash this last one? Yes, yes. I hear, I hear more. I hear more going on still. Oh, nearly, nearly, nearly. We can do that. We can do that. Right. No, it's got to be on when it's on the way up, not on the way down. Oh, and it's going to come right the way to the top as well. 
I'm gonna come right the way to the top. No. What I will say about the white palaces, like the respawn points are incredibly forgiving for you. Ah, didn't quite make it. There we go. Uh, oh no, we're just about in there. You can't, you can't Mantis Claw it. You've just got to jump, dash, and immediately jump off the other side. There you go. Too high, too high. Nope. This is a really challenging section, for sure. <gasps> no! <laughs> I don't know how you're supposed to see those coming, but okay. Okay, Crystal. Oh, great. More crystal dashing? Yep, more crystal dashing, definitely. Crystal dash, crystal dash. Dash, 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 dash. What are we gonna find? Oh, yep, we're still dashing. Let's let's stop our dash there. There's a king's mold. <gasps> Is this it? Are we here? Are we at the top? Wait, no. There's a thing, there's a lift that'll take us up that way. Okay, more soul. That implies there's more stuff. I don't hear any more saws, though. And the fact that there's a bunch of king's molds here. No, we can't do dreams within a dream. But here we are. Here we are. It's the king of Hallow Nest. the king's soul. And there we go. Soul of worm, soul of root, heart of void. And we've been kicked out of the dream and an entry added to our journal. What do we get? Wing mold. The bugs of Hallowist believe that their king created this world and everything in it. For what purpose, I wonder? Were his subjects companions or toys or children? Such a mind seems unknowable. We've also got royal retainer. Simple weak creatures find strength by forming a hive and obeying the ruler. Such creatures become the arms and the teeth and the claws of their monarch. Okay. Well... That, my friends, is going to be White Palace. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Hollow Knight. If you did, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. 
Next time out, we are going after Grim a little bit more. And I tell you what I've discovered, right? I found out that when we were looking up some things on the wiki. If you want to complete your uh, Hunter's Journal, the only way you can get your entry for Grim is to beat Nightmare King Grim in Dirtmouth. So that is what we are going to be trying to do. No banishing the, uh, yeah, no banishing the Grim troop here. We are going to be taking on Nightmare King Grim. We are also going back to the Abyss to turn our um, newly found charm black pretty quickly. Uh, the King's Soul opens the way to a birthplace. Join us next time. I'll see you soon. Bye for now.